with John. We've been talking a lot about Facebook this week. What happened in the Social Network shares today? Not down. They were up. Actually, at one point, this was the biggest percentage climb for the stock since May. Uh, this after an analyst came out with a relatively upbeat view. We haven't seen a lot of those, but this is tied to Facebook Exchange, which is a way that Facebook is trying to figure out potentially how they can make more advertising revenue in this report from Pivotal Research helping out the stock and the portfolio of Mark Zuckerberg. Remember yesterday he fell out of the top 10 tech billionaires list according to Bloomberg data. Another stock that was higher today, Open Table. They're the big player in restaurant reservations online. They came out with results this week. We talked a lot about LinkedIn yesterday, but this was a standout after hours. And uh, remember that the other big story of the week um, in a similar area was Yelp and their transition to mobile. Similar story with Open Table, which is also a key partner with Apple along with Yelp in the integration of uh, further integration with Siri. And then finally, a media name, Viacom, reporting its results earlier today. The advertising trend wasn't all that encouraging, but the numbers were okay with investors. The stock ended up the day higher. There's a lot of big questions surrounding this company right now. For example, their uh, agreement with Netflix on Epix. Uh, the CEO said today he's talking to some other players, possibly about teaming up with them when the Netflix deal expires. And of course, they just settled that uh, fight with DirecTV. And by the way, we reported yesterday that DirecTV's subscriber numbers were down 169,000 in their most recent quarter. It's actually 52,000.